So we're just working with the high wet strength tissue paper. We're going to put the paper into the water. We rest the paper onto the plastic sheet and the paper is completely transparent. And so now I'm going to come in with some a dry piece of kitchen towel and swipe off. Now I'm going to come in with a purple and we draw from the centre outwards. And this is a high, um, this is a artist quality water soluble wax. Now, a marriage made in heaven is pinks and purples. So I'm going to come in with a pink now and I go on top of the purple for smoke circular motions and blend it downwards. There are, there is also near colour two, the students range. Small circular motions once again. isn't a disaster because we can wash that out. One of the good things about this medium is that you can repair quite quickly. And I'm going to come in with wet, wet tissue and just wash that out. And then come back in with the yellow. Now a golden yellow just to finish it off. Centre of a till roll, a small plastic tube, full of high tech tools, and we blend the colours together. And I just clean off, and then just go backwards and forwards just to fine tune. And then we stop. Um, so that's how we do a basic colour blend and then from there we can come in and place a horizon line onto the artwork. So if we come in with some white acrylic paint and this is actually a gesso and I'll do this upside down for you. Um, I'm going to use a piece of kitchen towel just to take some moisture out and now we're going to run across the blend we go across, come back, and we zigzag down the blender colour. I'm going to take some more moisture out where I want to place the white paint. And we do our dot. Then I just want to add some shadow to the white dot. Nibble away at the edge. until the, the moon has cloud and shadow running across it. And there you have a little seascape in 